Hi, it's Mark Coleman from Paul's Photo and the Creative Photo Academy. We're getting ready for a trip and we're leaving tonight and I wanted to share with you my travel bag. You guys have seen my Africa Safari bag, you've seen my landscape bag. Well, this is my travel bag. This is the Think Tank Street Walker Pro V2 and I love this bag because it complements my travel kit perfectly. So let's first, I want to talk about my clothes for travel. Number one, I have a travel outfit on that all I need to do to go through the security at the airport, through the x-ray detector, through the metal detector, is to take off my watch and put my phone in my camera bag. And the rest of my kit, including my shoes and my belt, are all plastic so they don't set off the metal detector. How annoying is that when the person in front of you has to take everything off in front of them when they go through the metal detector. So I just, you know, and because I have TSA pre-check, I don't even have to take my shoes off. So I take my phone out, goes in the side pocket, watch in the side pocket, boom, I walk right through every single time. So think about your travel outfit, what you wear, so that it is not gonna trip the metal detector. So, the camera bag, Think Tank Streetwalker Pro V2. I love this bag because it carries what I need for travel. So first of all, in the back, you have the secret pocket where goes my passport. And my boarding pass and all that kind of stuff goes right there. On the outside, I have a pocket for a water bottle. Because whenever you're traveling internationally, you want to have a water bottle. You want to be able to fill up water where it's safe and carry it with you, not have to use a bunch of plastic bottles. On the side, I have a spot for a snack or something like that if I want. On the outside, I have flashlight, pen, business cards, room for extra glasses if I want. I have a strap where I can clip a jacket if I want to on the outside. So if we're out, it's raining, I've got my raincoat on, and now we're going to go inside, I want to take it off, I can clip it on the outside of the jacket, I mean the outside of the bag so that I don't get my camera stuff wet and I don't have to carry the jacket. Now the Think Tank bag is weather resistant. It does come with a rain jacket. In all of my years of photography and travel and all kinds of weather, I've never had to put the rain jacket on. So I just leave it just like this because if it's raining that hard, we're not going to be out photographing. So let's take a look inside. And I have a little bit different kit than what I normally do. Right here I have two extra batteries. I have my memory cards, I have lens cleaning cloth, an extra eye cup, that kind of stuff in here. And I have two cameras, and I want to show you that I have my Nikon Z8, my favorite camera for traveling right now, and the 24 to 120 lens, and you notice that they both have lens caps on them. Because when I travel, when I fly, I never have the camera attached to the lens. So when I get to my spot, I'm going to take the lens cap off, put it on, but it'll go back, back in the same spot. And now I'm safeguarded against twisting and turning and buckling and stuff like that. So this is a great way to travel. I have my second Z8. You notice this one has the red on the top. Why? That's right. This is my infrared camera. So I'm going to be able to shoot infrared photography in Thailand when we're there this week. Depends on the location whether I bring the infrared or not, but we're gonna have a lot of clouds and a lot of sun in Thailand and a lot of foliage, perfect for the infrared. So the 24 to 120, awesome travel lens. You know, when we just went to England last month, that's the only lens I took and it was a great kit. Now, because we're gonna be in a lot of temples and such like that in Thailand, I'm bringing the 14 to 30 wide angle lens. Now, you notice that I'm bringing the compact lenses from Nikon. So Canon, Sony, Fuji, everyone has compact lenses as well. That's what I travel with. And I have the brand new compact 70 to 180 telephoto lens from Nikon. I'm leaving my heavier 70 to 200 at home. I just don't have that much need for it, so I'm leaving that at home, bringing the 70 to 180. And finally, I've added a fourth lens to the kit, and this is the 40 millimeter F2 Prime. I'm really looking forward to doing the night markets and the street photography in Bangkok with the 40 F2 in extremely low light levels. So you can see I have a small kit 
It's going to fit in the overhead of any airliner. I'm going to be able to carry it with me wherever I go. And because this has my passport and everything in it, this never leaves my side when I'm traveling. So wherever I go, this comes with me. We're going to have a great time photographing out and about. Where are you going to go next? What kit are you going to take with you? I like this one, Nikon Z8 with the Streetwalker Pro, four lenses, and I'm going to get some rocking pictures. Look for some fun videos and photos from our adventure, and I can't wait for you to join us. Mark Coleman from Paul's Photo and the Creative Photo Academy. Let's get out, take a picture, and share it.